my life seemed like a waste of time. From Mexico City to Acapulco. But before that, check out this badass restroom. Why is it badass? Because it shows some of the badass women involved in the Mexican Revolution. Yeah, women in war, girl power. At them, so we press trigger when you press people button or whatever the artists say, if you know, you know. I don't know why the bathroom may fascinate me so much, but I just think it's cool. Next thing you know, two tools, we reach Acapulco. Now, me is a girl with love when the seed come and see everything. I'm a camera for your people over the body lap. On this day, the weather was not weathering. Everything did just look dark and gloomy, but to me, it was still pretty. It was a breeze through customs, and we just grabbed a taxi outside of the airport and made our way to the resort. We are very, very, very we have the more expensive hotel. Yep. This Asiatic hotel. Asiatic. You know Asiatic hotel? It's the same to the villa. Look at the corner of the other mouth, we have the, the villas. There. Oh, yeah, the villas on the... Uh, this is Asiatic hotel, this is more expensive hotel. We reached the hotel well early so we couldn't check in just yet but we did check in our bags and just kill some time down at the beachfront of our hotel. A few hours later our room was ready and man was it worth the wait. We did already do a walkthrough because you know girl did excited, girl did eager. We did mostly gloomy. The video never did a little place no justice. Believe you me views we got a double balcony overlooking the sea i never know what to really expect but one thing me know i was pleased nice big bed and views from every angle Now look at me well happy, but me go hang out by the beach. Little did I know, the universe had different plans for me. Next thing I know, me ears are wake up on jet ski, and I can't swim. But me say, you know what? Me I go, because when again this I got happened to me. Two tools jet ski brought down, and the instructor have to paddle it to one boat, and we have to stay up on the boat till they bring him another jet ski. Can you imagine? No one would think the adventure would have done right there, so. But no, we move. Remember the little piece of island we did out in the sea when we did that little room tour? This little piece of island, this same one, that was the destination. At this way I go. All the way I go on to my surprise, I didn't feel unsafe. Because for one, I had a life vest. And two, I was with two other people that could swim. So after we reached me here, so we have to go jump off in the water for go up on shore. Because apparently the jet ski will get banged up against the rocks. So me said no, Mr. Sir. You yeah, have to go bring it closely because me not jumping on the water. So he did just that and that's how I got there. So the little island where we depend is called Rock Island. It's like the name suggests. I just not but rocks. But apparently if you climb to the top, you can see all of Acapulco Bay and all the nice views from up there. Mama, the walk, the church house. If you're afraid of heights and if you're squirmish, nobody do this. But if you're adventurous and want to see the nice things, I would highly recommend it. I uh, make them stairs there. It felt so secluded and private and the views, the views, the views. At this point, I made it well tired, but it was worth it. Spent two hours over there and just looked at the views, watched the ship go by. There's our hotel. Yes, excitement. After all that work, I made it hungry, so we went back over to the other side to our hotel and had some lunch and had some prime entertainment. This is why you know for love front page all the time. I said a wave did box both the people in. To top off the day, we ended it with a sunset cruise on the Akeri, if I saw it pronounced. 
we got another little ferry type barge thing to go on the main boat drinks and refreshments was included and me I tell you say them keep the beverage them come in every time I put on my glass the man in a red shirt him tap me up it's like him just a wait for me to put on my glass oh yeah it's also called the love boat one of the highlights of the cruise was this little boy he was swimming and then he just told us to like throw coins and we threw the coins and he like dived down into the water and catch them me to thinking how much coins are there in probably Calic? this boy is a hustler but he can't knock the hustler Queremos con mucho gusto informarles que son tres niveles los que tenemos a su entera disposición en la primera cubierta. And because it is a tour, they basically told us about Acapulco every time we passed a place of significance, them explain what it was and who did live there and who did own this and all of that. The cruise was really nice. Make a shut up now and just yeah, enjoy the rest of the video. This man right here, if you follow him, you're junk. Anyways, enjoy. Un cóctel de pescado que se prepara en Guerrero se llama ceviche. Se sirve con galletas saladas y con sus salsas. We basically just had drinks, had some little finger food to eat and enjoy the views and watch the sunset for the rest of the evening. I think this is the next day and we visited Chapela de la Paz or Chapel of Peace. It's located on one of the highest points in Acapulco. And from the chapel, you can have a great view of Acapulco Bay. The chapel was built in memory of two brothers who died in a plane crash and stands as a symbol of peace in Acapulco. The chapel is non-denominational, which means many religious denominations can worship and even get married there. It named the chapel of peace for a reason because I felt at peace there. It was so tranquil and the views from the chapel was so amazing. If it looks up on a gloomy day, imagine how beautiful it is when the sun is shining bright. The chapel is home to the Triet family's remains who built the chapel. The hands was built in honor of the two brothers that died and the cross can be seen from every angle in Acapulco. After leaving the chapel, we had a tour of Acapulco and also of the neighborhood that once was, meaning that a lot of people moved to this neighborhood back in the day and they know it's kind of abandoned so most of the houses are empty or for sale for whatever reason but it was just great to have a little history you know and background of what we were actually seeing and it was just so nice so if you have a little money you can probably move in one of them houses yeah? <laughs> after the city tour we visited the cliff divers of la quebrada the La Quebrada is one of the most famous tourist attractions in Acapulco, Mexico, where you have divers entertaining tourists by jumping off cliffs, may I tell you. Like one of them are 40 feet high and one of them are 80 feet high. That well high. To get the best view in the house, you have to basically descend some stairs to go closer to where the divers are. You're not there, you're on the other side actually. But the closer you get, the better the view, obviously. So you have these restaurants on the outskirts. If you want to have lunch or dinner while watching the cliff divers, that's a possibility. And look upon them and them in the water. Look upon the water or rough. Oh my God. Tell me you now if they don't deserve every penny. Them man in the normal, them are aquaman a cousin. They can look upon them waters that are treacherous. Look how them choppy. No, sir. So basically, them climb up on the cliff, them go down in the water, climb up on the side of the cliff. People up on them cruise, they there watch them and wait for them jump off. So yeah, them climb up on the cliff, no stairs, no nothing, the people them scale the cliff side. Them timing are for perfect, so them basically wait and watch until the timing is right and then them chuck off, them dive. I thought it was amazing because boy the man are brave. Not for the weak, this is not for the faint. The man them are free dive from 80 feet high. Tell me if that not impressive. Tipping is highly recommended and them deserve every penny because they risk it for the biscuit. 
it was really worth it and it was 10 out of 10 experience look at these views wow if you've made it this far thank you so much for watching and see you in the next one bye